Kingdom Hearts 2 Final Mix is agreed upon by most of the Kingdom Hearts community as the best Kingdom Hearts game. When it comes down to story, gameplay, character development, worlds, and overall what you do and how you do the things you do, Kingdom Hearts 2 is the best. That's a lot of do's. There's lots of expectations fans are expecting Kingdom Hearts 3 to meet. Will it meet or exceed those expectations? I sure hope so. What's going on ladies and gentlemen of YouTube? It's War Prodigy back at it again with another Kingdom Hearts video on the channel for you guys. Today we'll be talking about if Kingdom Hearts 3 can surpass Kingdom Hearts 2 Final Mix. So let's flash back to 0.2 Birth by Sleep. 0.2 Birth by Sleep is like the alpha test for Kingdom Hearts 3. Reason I say alpha is because when I play 0.2 and then look at Kingdom Hearts 3 trailers, Kingdom Hearts 3 in terms of gameplay, just based off the trailers alone, is leaps and galaxies ahead of 0.2. That's of course an obvious statement like it's Kingdom Hearts 3, come on. But to my point, 0.2 does still give us insight on what Kingdom Hearts 3 might feel like. Like. And I really like the direction they're heading. In terms of gameplay, if I was ranking how much I like 0.2, I'd say it's tied with Kingdom Hearts 1 for me. I liked it just as much, if not more, than the gameplay in that game and I really love Kingdom Hearts 1. 0.2's gameplay was extremely satisfying and it of course has negatives but I feel like a massively improved upon 0.2 combat system, which is Kingdom Hearts 3, has lots of potential to become better than Kingdom Hearts 2. Part of what made Kingdom Hearts 2's gameplay so great was because it was also satisfying and the game was very balanced. There's multiple ways to beat an enemy, there's multiple ways to beat a boss, there's a lot of strategy in the combat that other games don't offer as much of. On top of that, the gameplay continuously improved upon itself as the game progressed. As you leveled up, as you progressed through the story, you got more drive forms, more summons, more abilities, limits, keyblades. You had lots of choices in regards to how you fight. And we all love that. We still love that. Kingdom Hearts 3 is going to be building off of what made Kingdom Hearts 2 so great, and it's adding more to that. Plus, to add even more to that, they're bringing back the things we loved in previous games and new things like flow motion and from Dream Drop Distance and keyblade transformations and attraction flow. While for a person like me, having this much choice in how I fight my enemies is super exciting, for others, they're worried this could lead to a balancing issue. Especially since that's what games like Birth by Sleep and Dream Drop Distance suffer from. And they were made by a different team from the team that developed Kingdom Hearts 1 and Kingdom Hearts 2. This team is the Osaka team. That's also a lot of teams. And there's plenty of talk about them and their mistakes, but I have faith with them with Kingdom Hearts 3. I honestly do. They are also getting help from the original team that did Kingdom Hearts 1 and 2 as well. Square Enix with Kingdom Hearts 3 is using a different engine compared to what they've been using for a lot of their games for a long time, including the Kingdom Hearts series, and that engine is the Unreal Engine 4. It's clear that they've gotten used to the engine by now and are using its capabilities as much as they can. Kingdom Hearts 3 is looking very colorful, very flashy, and from what I've seen from the trailers, things look very alive, the world's breathing. I firmly believe Kingdom Hearts 3 will be my favorite Kingdom Hearts game, and not just mine, I think the game will be good enough to be everyone's favorites. I have high hopes for Kingdom Hearts 3. That doesn't mean I'm expecting anything super specific or anything. The only thing I expect from Kingdom Hearts 3 is for it to be a great game. Nothing more, nothing less. Do you think Kingdom Hearts 3 will be better than Kingdom Hearts 2? Let me know in the comment section below. While you remember to do that, also remember to leave a like since it tells me you enjoy these type of videos and would love to see more. Share the video with a friend. This is the biggest reason we've been growing on the channel as fast as we have, so if we could keep that momentum going, it would be great. Doesn't matter where you share it either. It can be through Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, through a Discord server, or through a friend or family member via text message, or through word of mouth. It all helps a ton. It's been helping a ton. Thank you guys. Last, but most definitely not least, if you're not already a part of the Union, what are you doing? Subscribe. We're closing in on 800 subscribers fast, and then it's 900, and then it's to the big four-digit number 1K. Thank you guys for all the love, all the support on the past few videos. You guys are the best. I love all of you. My name is Prodigy, and I'll talk to you guys soon. Peace out.